Hombale Films brings to you RCB 12th Man TV. Despite multiple rain interruptions that threatened to produce another washout in the Asia Cup, Team India managed securing a victory against Nepal with 10 wickets in hand. We scored our 145 runs in 20.1 overs, thereby making it to the Super Fours. This win against Nepal means that this Sunday, all eyes will be on yet another India-Pakistan clash. But before we get there, let's take a look at how the India-Nepal match transpired. Indian skipper Rohit Sharma won the toss and put Nepal into bat, with the rain coming down even during toss time. Once the match began, Nepal got off to a bright start before Shardul Thakur struck, bringing about India's first wicket before the power play ended. And then arrived Sir Ravindra Jadeja. Jadeja struck thrice in the space of his four overs as Nepal soon found themselves struggling at 101 for four in 21.5 overs. However, handy contributions from Nepal's lower order halted India's momentum as the former, to their credit, put up a strong show with the bat to get to 230. Nepal did well with the bat, but were they good with the ball too? Well, not quite. It was quite a walk in the park for the Indian openers who barely broke a sweat while chasing the target. Although the heavens opened up after 2.1 overs into India's chase, Rohit Sharma and Shubman Gill returned to the crease with 145 runs to score in 23 overs after the rain break. Coming out with an aggressive intent, both the openers struck half-centuries to take India over the line without any fuss at all. So what were the big positives for India from the Nepal game? Number 1. India's Openers After India's disappointing batting effort against Pakistan, the middle order didn't even need to come out to bat. Rohit and Shubman brought out their A game in what was effectively a little longer than a 20-over innings to help India seal an emphatic 10-wicket win. Number 2. Jadeja's Guile with the Ball Under circumstances which were suitable for pace bowling, it was Ravindra Jadeja who brought all his expertise to the fore, applying serious breaks to the Nepal batting effort with his range of deliveries to finish with figures of 3 for 40 from his 10 overs. So, what does this mean for Team India? After that victory against Nepal, we've made it to the Super Fours, which means Super Sunday. 10th of September starts another chapter of this India-Pakistan rivalry. And there's no better place for you to enjoy this live screening than being here at the RCB Bar and Cafe. So get your game faces on, get your team jerseys ready and join us right here at the RCB Bar and Cafe for yet another India-Pakistan clash. Thank you.